this video because you're feeling sick or maybe you're about to get sick or maybe you just want to learn some sick day life hacks from Mama Chu. Well, you're in the right place. My mom is the queen of making me feel better when I'm sick. I don't even live at home and I haven't for a really long time, but whenever I'm sick, she knows exactly what I need to do to get better. Moms are angels, they really are. So today I'll be sharing with you some of Mama Chu's sick day life hacks so that you can start feeling better. If you guys love health videos like this one, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button and notification button so we get to hang out every single week. Sorry mom, I'm sharing more of your secrets, but sharing is caring and mamas know best. Are you guys ready? Let's get started. All right, let's get started with Mama Chu's best sick day hack, the cold blasting turmeric tea. You'll need a few slices of ginger, which helps with sore throats and upset stomach, some lemon slices, which help boost your immune system, and the star of the show, turmeric. Turmeric has been shown to be one of the best anti-inflammatory herbs to keep you healthy, especially when you're sick. I add about a tablespoon of this to a pot of boiling water, and then add in the lemon slices, the ginger slices, and then two tablespoons of honey. Once that's done, give it a stir, turn down the heat to medium, let it simmer, and then cover. I let this simmer for about 10 minutes, let it cool, and then I drink it warm. Whenever I'm sick, I always make a bunch of this and give it to Jeff to drink as well. Just in case, you never know. It tastes great and I find it makes me feel so much better when I'm feeling under the weather. One of the best tips Mama Chu taught me is to keep your feet warm. Yes, your feet. In traditional Chinese medicine, they say if your feet are cold, the circulation to your nose and upper respiratory tract is compromised. So be sure to keep your tootsies warm. And for this, I use my handy magic bag. I seriously love this thing. It's like my second cuddle buddy after Jeff. Next up, Mama Chu always taught me about acupressure. So when you're sick, usually your head feels like it's about to blow up. So to help with easing the pain, start in the eye socket, at the spot where the eyebrows meet the bridge of the nose. Apply pressure to both sides for a few minutes to help sinus congestion and headaches. Up next, find the pressure point located at the bottom of the cheekbones, parallel to the pupils. This can help with decongestion and that burning sensation in the eyes. And lastly, the third eye. This is a common spot for Chinese acupuncture and it's located right between the eyebrows. Apply medium pressure here to help lower fevers and headaches. When my brother and I were kids, my mom would always rub this medicated oil on our temples when we were sick. It definitely has a strong smell to it, but it's actually very effective to help with dizziness, blocked nose, headaches, and even insect bites. So I always have a bottle with me at all times, just in case. And last but not least, Mama Chu always taught us to drink warm water, never cold. I mean, not even cold water. Always clear broth, warm water, and no dairy of any kind. Mom would always say, dairy clogs your system, so always stick to clear, warm fluids whenever you're sick. And now, we're done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some tips on how to get better. I feel for you if you're feeling sick or you're not feeling well. I hope these tips help. Also, if you're a mama or your grandma or someone you know shared any sick day life hacks with you, comment below because we want to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in and I hope you guys feel better and I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now. If you want to see more, click the links here and watch them now.